Hey everybody, how you doing? I have a video for you today, uh, but before we get started, I just want to say this is my new channel. Make sure you subscribe. Uh, lost the old one. But today we're going to be going over fake Zippos and how to spot them. And here's how you spot them. You start off with the box. If you know the box is fake, you can assume the Zippo inside might be fake too. But there's a lot of different things to tell from a fake Zippo than a fake uh, box. So like if I had sold my Zippos in a draw sale or on online or something, and I put two real Zippos into two fake boxes, that doesn't mean the Zippos are fake. But here's how to spot a fake box. I was going through my boxes and I was going through things and I just, with my keen eye, I was able to pick these out and find them. Uh, now the boxes, I don't really remember where I got them from. Uh, I just, I, you collect so many, right? And like I bought in boxes uh, with no Zippos in it and everything like that. I just try to get boxes because I have more Zippos that aren't in boxes than Zippos that are in boxes, right? So I collect boxes just to kind of fill up my collection so all my Zippos just aren't standing in my shelf and uh, don't have a home. I feel like, you know, the box is the home for the Zippo. So here is a real box. Okay, here, which one is it? Okay, so that's a freebie. Okay, look at this one. Ordered right from Zippo, premium box. All right, I know the first fact this is an authentic Zippo. I ordered it from Zippo. So we'll look at the back. Keep a close eye to these markings. These all mean something. Uh, the design, the codes, everything all means something on here. The size, the color, where the placement of the lettering is. Now, all these boxes, I know you're looking at this and it's a premium box. So here's a regular box. This is my abstract Zippo I got for free. It's not a premium box. You will see it has identical markings. Doesn't matter that the inside is a premium version, right? All right, so we've gotten that out of the way. But first, before we move on, let's look at this etching on here, okay? See, it's, it doesn't have a pattern, okay? It's hard to see, but you could see it doesn't have a pattern. It's like a snake skin or something like that. I don't know. It's just a bunch of small rounded circles in there that aren't perfect circles. They're just funny shaped. Uh, you could probably see in the video what they look like. But let's take a look at these two boxes. Look at the crossed etched pattern, okay? Zippo doesn't do this, all right? This is the only box in my collection that looks like this. And you can see, look, they got the red enamel, everything like that. Everything looks clean on this box. But it is not authentic. And we'll start going over the differences. I'll show you the insides. But let's go over the differences. You can tell right away. See how Zippo, the authentic Zippo box is moved off to the left. Uh, sometimes they're in the center. They don't get printed the same every time. So don't go by the position of this, right? Because it looks, in the legitimate one, it looks farther off to the left than the fake one, right? The fake one's centered right out. Uh, you could see the dots are a little different. I don't know if you could see that on camera, but like, they have the same style. And another thing you can see, there's an off difference in color. This, These fake boxes are always going to be brighter paint for some reason. Uh, I, I don't know I don't know if Zippo does that on purpose. And you can see they're not even the same dimensions. Look, I'm holding them right at the exact moment. Look, look at the top. The fake is longer, just by a millimeter it looks like. So, a bunch of subtle differences like that. Now let's look at the back. All right, look at no code, no code right there. This one has a code. This one has a code on the side, also no code. Look at how much bigger the writing and text is on this one. It's massive compared to the authentic one. This one's authentic, this one's fake. Uh, the symbols are in the wrong order. There's an additional symbol from an old Zippo box that they put on. <laughs> So, like, you know, it's it's just funny. I'm surprised they even have gotten the address right. Uh, but see, look at here, Zippo.com, all lowercase, Zippo.com, capital Z, right? Somebody was doing that on their computer. Uh, even the genuine Zippo lighter made in USA, much bigger, much bigger on the fake box. And then, so, let's go inside. Let's go inside and take a look on the inside of the box. Uh, this one didn't have a guarantee in it or anything. It had no paper in it. 
All right, so we see we got the Facebook, Twitter, YouTube, Hong Kong patent number. Because <laughs> uh, the boxes are made in Hong Kong, I believe, or something like that. Uh, so let's take a look here. Let's take... So we know this one's good. This is my street chrome I got for free from Zippo. This is a mystery Zippo they gave me for free. So we know this box is authentic. Let's take a look and see what it says on the inside. So they have removed the Facebook, Twitter, and YouTube. Uh, this is probably based on a 2019 model. That's when, the, uh, that's when the boxes used to have this in there. So this is probably based on a 2019 box. Uh, you could see the felts on the inside are a little different. Well, yeah, they look like it looks like the edge is fatter on this one than this one. On on you can see the dimple on the line there. But anyway, so this is what the inside looks like. See, it still says it has a Hong Kong patent number, uh, and it's the same number. And they removed everything. But, just trying to find any more major differences. So in this, on the fake one, the Made in USA is pushed over to the right more. See that? See how this Made in USA is more centered and the A is far away from this piece of felt? And, and this one, it's very, very close. So subtle differences you can make when holding them together. So... We will put that back and give this proper lid back. Don't want to be mixing these up. All right, so now I have found a, another fake box in my collection. Uh, but this one is even more, even more noticeable. Like this one, you might be able to get away with. People might look at this and never think that that was a uh, fake Zippo box, not made by Zippo. So look at this one, another fake Zippo box. What's the first thing we notice? The lines. See how this one's more of an unpatterned, dotted, rough leather looking design? This one has the lines all the way down it, whereas this one has the checkers, right? So always look at that. Now, let's put this more closer to a real one. All right, so this one's more the same size of a Zippo. Still a little bit taller, it looks like. Still like a millimeter taller when you line these up even. But, uh... Look at the poor printing quality where it says Zippo. I don't know if that comes up on camera, but look at the blotchiness in the letters. Uh, very sloppily done, whereas the Zippo is more defined. This is very, very bright white paint. This one isn't. Uh, and then let's take a look on the back. <laughs> Boom! Look at that. Look at that. Big difference, you know. There's some hieroglyphs on there and some sort of lettering. Uh, now, there is a code on the one side, right here, but see, it has the flame on the back, on the fake one, and all this Chinese lettering. Let's see on the inside here. They even have Chinese lettering on the, on the guarantee, so now, like, I don't know if this is a fake Zippo or a Zippo that sold in China, I don't know. Probably not. I highly doubt that. But uh, so everyone, those are just a few observations when going through your boxes, uh, hints and tips to look for to see if you have acquired a fake Zippo, if your Zippo is real. Uh, you got to start with the box, right? You'll know whether the box is authentic and original or not. So those are just some differences I wanted to show you. I hope you found the video, video useful. If you want to check back out on the channel, I got more videos and uh, please subscribe. I'll see you in the next one.